Now, if you're a fan of this channel, you know since Endgame, we have been theorizing that the next mega event for Marvel is very likely to be Secret Wars. The Russo brothers have made no secret about their interest in adapting the comic series, and recently some discussions from Marvel with the original writer Jim Shooter have convinced many people the adaptation is on its way. Let's take a couple minutes to break down what Jim Shooter said and the possibilities of Secret Wars coming to the big screen. Now before we dive in, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for all the updates. Also, don't forget about the big giveaway. We got this PlayStation 5 to give away at 25,000 subscribers. All you have to do to get in on our giveaway is be a subscriber and leave a comment. And while you're at it, check out that buy me a coffee link down below. It's an awesome way to support this channel with a tiny bit of pocket change, all while not creating any reoccurring obligation for yourself. We really appreciate it. Now, like I was saying, we've been theorizing here since Endgame came out that Secret Wars is very likely Marvel's next big mega event. But there's really been no word from Marvel Studios on plans for the adventures in the MCU following Endgame. Now, in case you didn't know, there's been a few adaptations of the story. There was one back in 85, and more recently, one in 2015. Many believe if Marvel Studios should adapt this, they'll likely combine the two stories and create something new. Now, the original writer of Secret Wars, Jim Shooter, recently made an appearance at Megacon. And he was asked by Geekosity Magazine if he thinks a version of the event could somehow make its way up to the big screen. Now, his answers were pretty interesting. And he started off by saying that someone from Marvel recently offered him $10,000 to write a novelization of Secret Wars. Before making sure they had secured the rights to the storyline, he said, This one clown called me from Marvel. He wasn't an editor, but some executive of property management, which was a little odd. He asked me if I wanted to write a novelization of Secret Wars. Now, Shooter added that he was also sent a retroactive work-for-hire contract that he turned down before David Bogart, who is Senior Vice President of Operations and Procurement at Marvel Entertainment, contacted him and apologized. Apparently, he then offered him $10,000, despite the fact Shooter was pretty aware of his previous contract with the company was work-for-hire. Work-for-hire means he has no rights to the characters he created on behalf of the company. Now, while Marvel didn't have to retroactively pay him, Bogart apparently insisted he take the money offered, because why not? Apparently, Jim Shooter asked him, this means you're making a movie, right? And he replied, I'm not allowed to tell you that. To which Shooter apparently replied, well, I think he did. Now, what's interesting here is Marvel didn't actually have a piece of paper that definitively states that they owned the Beyonder, Titania, Spider-Woman... Spider-Man's black alien costume, and all the other bits and pieces of the story, which is apparently what facilitated this call. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean any of these concepts or pieces of that story will be part of the movie version, but it's likely Marvel Studios securing all the rights and making sure there's no legal ramifications once something goes into production. This is pretty standard operating procedure, but it should give us a clue on what Marvel has planned for the future. With the multiverse exploding the way it is, there's zero doubt Secret Wars is on the horizon. It's something we've talked about many times here for quite a while, so it shouldn't be a big surprise, but it is really good to see the movie is starting to come together. I think the key things to make this work are, number one, get the Russo brothers back to combine all these elements together, and number two, don't rush it. It likely needs to be a two-picture deal, if not more. I actually could see a whole phase of the MCU dedicated just to Secret Wars. But we'll have to wait and see. What do you guys think? Are you ready for an MCU adaptation of Secret Wars? And if so, how do you feel about the Russo brothers heading up that effort? Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.